Why am I so hyped up on conditioning? Well, it's the one thing that I've found to help folks get through plateaus, but also reduce cholesterol, reduce blood pressure issues, work on putting that heart rate in check, also working on stress management and anxiety. So, little background on me. I've had anxiety most of my life, and the only way I could really combat it was exercise, until I couldn't. Why? Because I was pushing myself way too hard in workouts, where I would do Tabata workouts over and over again, because that was a trend. I went through CrossFit and just pushed myself and pushed myself, because it felt good, right? It was my stress management, but I wasn't recovering. And what I was also seeing was myself gaining weight more and more weight and going, what the heck is wrong? I'm a doc, I know all of the things, I have the background, I know what to do. I've cut my calories. I've basically, I'm eating gluten-free, dairy-free, you know, I've cut all of the joy out. There's no more alcohol, I've, I've taken all these things out. And I'm like, okay, I still haven't lost weight. What is going on here? Why is my body not changing? I didn't pay attention to my heart rate, monitoring my heart rate and paying attention to my conditioning. As soon as I started doing that and working on that with patients, I started to see change. Now, I regret that I took quite a while to learn this. I'm in my 40s now. I've been practicing 15 years. I've seen lots of patients that we couldn't get them through plateaus in their weight. And it really boiled down to because they were stressed out, because they had adrenal issues, meaning that these little glands that sit on top of your kidneys were fatigued, they weren't producing cortisol like they should, I thought they had to slow down and not work as hard. But what it was is they weren't pushing themselves in the proper manner with the proper amount of recovery. They were underachieving and not recovering enough. They, and, and, or overachieving and not recovering enough. In my case, pushing myself to the limit with CrossFit day in, day out and wondering why am I getting heavier? Why do I have this fat suit over my body? Like what the heck is going on? That was it. And when you're in the fitness industry and you're a doc, you tend to have a little bit of like, what's wrong with me? Why am I still chubby? Why am I not ripped out like everyone else? You know what? That's okay. You don't have to be because if you have a good heart, right? And I mean good heart, joy, happy, help people, but good heart that's working well, you can keep your heart rate in check. So you have an extra little bit of weight. That's okay. It will come off. It will adjust. Because I'd much rather be fit and have a good functioning heart. Because unfortunately, I see so many people who are extremely fit, ripped out, look amazing, but their conditioning is not good. Their longevity is not going to be there. That's why we want our heart healthy. The number one killer of ladies is heart disease. Number one killer. Why is that? Because ladies take on everything, right? We take on our family, we take on parents, we take on the weight of the world, right? We're doers. We are just like, I got this, I take care of everyone. Then we forget to take care of ourselves. And then if we are working out, we're seeing things, we're just pushing ourselves, we're not seeing results, we're fatigued, we're more tired, then we give up. I don't wanna see anybody give up. This is why I started incorporating conditioning into my practice and working on folks with conditioning because it is the one thing that we can improve until the day we die. And it's the one thing that keeps us independent too. So paying attention to your heart rate, getting a, a band like the M5, this is from Morpheus. They have an app that connects into your phone. And this is what I use to monitor my heart rate during workouts to make sure that I'm getting into the zone to boost my mitochondria so they can get past plateaus, but that I'm also getting into recovery zones and putting my body into the proper amount of recovery that it needs to keep me healthy and to keep me from having plateaus, to keep me progressing, to keep me strong, keep my heart strong and help me to manage stress more effectively in life and with my workouts and my hobbies and my sports. So that is why I am so psyched about conditioning. It is the best thing that can really help you with your longevity, but also help you manage stress at the same time. I'm Dr. Janine Krauss. Thanks for watching.